Welcome to your Ethereum News Roundup. Here's your latest for Monday, July 15th, 2024. Spot Ethereum ETFs are anticipated to go live next Tuesday. Matcha integrates the 0x v2 pricing engine. Tyco introduces booster rollups. And Scroll surpasses a billion dollars in TVL. All this and more starts right after this message. This episode is sponsored by Harpy, an on chain security solution for Ethereum based wallets. Harpy helps you detect and prevent malicious transactions before they execute, safeguarding your assets from theft in real time. Secure your wallet for free at harpy.io forward slash ETH daily. Bloomberg analyst Eric Bolchanis now anticipates that trading for spot Ethereum ETFs will commence by Tuesday, July 23rd. He stated that today, the SEC responded to amended S1 forms submitted by issuers and requested the final submission of S1s by this Wednesday. The Form S1 filings must be approved before trading can begin. On May 23rd of this year, the SEC gave the green light to 19 B4 filings for 8 spot ETH ETF applications. The price of ETH is up over 7% in the last 24 hours, moving from 3200 to 3450 Matcha launched the latest iteration of its DEX aggregator, featuring a new pricing engine built on 0x protocol v2. The advanced engine sources liquidity from multiple sources in a single swap, ensuring optimal pricing for large trades. The release introduces Argon Router, a sophisticated mechanism that uses multiplex and multi-hop trade routes. Multiplex routing splits orders into multiple trades across various liquidity sources, minimizing price impact, while multi-hop functionality uses intermediate tokens with more efficient liquidity, reducing slippage. Matcha also uses Permit 2 for token approvals, allowing exact allowance approvals for the duration of the transaction, removing the need to revoke approvals. The DEX aggregator also features MAV protection and gasless trades. Matcha claims to offer access to 97% of the liquidity on Ethereum, Base, Arbitrum, and Optimism. Tyco introduced Gwyneth, a synchronously composable based rollup that extends Ethereum Layer 1. Coined as a booster rollup, Gwyneth leverages native sequencing for seamless access to rollups and Layer 1 state. It also supports pre confirmations, allowing Layer 1 validators to commit to Layer 2 states, enhancing user experience with fast transaction confirmations. Gwyneth addresses Layer 2 fragmentation by enabling applications and smart contracts to operate across multiple rollups without the need for complex bridging solutions. Initially, Gwyneth will be secured by Tyco's Ryko multi-prover and will support ZKVMs for real-time proving. Gwyneth is still in a development phase. And lastly, Scroll, an EVM equivalent ZK rollup, has surpassed $1 billion in total value locked, marking a more than 20% increase in its TVL over the past 24 hours, according to data from L2B. The achievement places Scroll among the top 10 rollups by TVL, overtaking StarkNet. The surge comes amid a market rally and the anticipation of an upcoming token launch for the rollup. Scroll's ZK EVM first went live on mainnet in October of 2023. In other news, MakerDAO governance approves a decrease in the DAI savings rate to 7% and MetaMask releases auto detection for tokens. This has been a roundup of today's top news stories in Ethereum. You can support this podcast by subscribing and following us on X at ETH Daily. Also subscribe to our newsletter at ethdaily.io. Thanks for listening. We'll see you tomorrow.